Hey. But. Oh. Hey. I'm sorry I spiked you, okay? I just, I get so mad and I can't control things. And then, you know, shit just falls on top of me. My life sucks right now and I don't know what to do except I want to say I love you and hug it out. But all that wimpy shit is just... Well, I'd say gay, but I have some friends who are gay, so that's not cool anymore. And the ones that I don't really like, it's not because they're gay. So, lame, all right? You are just a lame and angry psycho sometimes. You do bad shit and things. I don't know if I love you, and I'm pretty sure I... I hate you a little bit. I'm just so fucking upset that we can't even see each other. And you're just a drunk, lame dad. You know what? That might just be the nicest thing anybody's ever said to me. Mom said she was at Bean Machine. been happening. You know, uh, I don't know, stuff? No, I don't know. Well, what's been happening with you? Fabian too? Oh, what a treat. Guess we better walk up to him. Look, Caffeine. Come on. Your curling has been sluggish for weeks. Excuse me, I'm trying to write a screen. Shush, here. woman. Hey, Amanda. Fabian. Michael. Hi, Mom. Hi, Jimmy. These two. A picture of holistic well being, I don't think. Hey. Maybe they shit once a year between them. Hey, oh! That's my son! Amanda, come. I have a new unit out on hold. You must pay for it. Hey! Hey! Buddy, I'm gonna ask politely that you show my wife a little respect.
red meat has been blocking your chi as well as your digestive tract. I ain't even gonna go there. I'm gonna ask you one time, nicely. Michael, just hit him, please. Shush, woman! Anything for you, sweetheart. What? what, what are you ah, ah. Ah. I had some really good work there, you dick! There's a lot more where that came from, Holmes. Was he alive? <laughs> yeah, he's fine. Listen, Amanda. I want. Tracy's meant to be at the tattoo parlor. Chris, where's what? Tattoo parlor? No, the tattoo. The one Tracy's getting. She's not getting a tattoo. Well, what the hell? She, she's with Laszlo. We came her shame. She's trying to persuade him to give her another shot. At humiliating herself? Look, I'm her harshest critic. She's a terrible dancer. She can't sing or even really speak properly in a camera or, like, form her thoughts into sentences. But there's a certain, like, childish honesty about the way she expresses herself that an audience might really respond to. Or... At least respond to for long enough for her to get on the Zila celebrity circuit, which is at least a step up from her other career prospects. All right, then. I think we should do what we can to help her get that gig. I think they're in here. Looking for something hip that, you know, says I'm capable of violence, but I'm awesome in the sack. So listen, babe. If you want to make it in Vinewood, you got to do whatever it takes. Even if whatever it takes is a depressed borderline alcoholic who hosts the third most popular talent show amongst the 40-year-old female demographic. So you'll let me on the show if I blow you? Yes. And if you could wear some black lipstick, the little guy loves the golf vibe. Oh. Whoa, whoa. Laszlo. <laughs> Dude, that was entirely out of context, bro. Jim, you find the ink slinger, sit on him. Laszlo is going to have a little cosmetic work done. No, please. Oh, stay 
quick, you lame ass mark. Uh, sure, kid. What? I'm by coastal. I can't have metal on my fucking face. Ugh. Ah, you made me a pouty fucking hipster. You're not gonna give me a Prince Albert, are you? Vegan! Fuck! Ah! 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 Oh. Come on! My punk days are long behind me, man! God! Now I really look like I'm having a fucking midlife crisis! Junk, okay? I'm already scarred down there. Ah. Ah, fuck the paparazzi, you're gonna love this. Come on, just off the tongue. I need that for my work. How does it look? I mean, be honest. this right please don't put a gang symbol on me please don't tattoo a cock this is gonna make my man tits look enormous should I draw his three pubic hairs there we go Nice. Uh, you got like a camera phone or a mirror? I can. Oh yeah, I'll get you a mirror. Smash uh, you over the head with it. Too fast. Nice uh, 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 snip, snip. Oh, this is a real one-stop shop. Look, we can work this out. Like men, you know, if you catch my drift. Oh, no, that's my, that's my signature, my ponytail. Now I gotta get extensions. No, what you gotta get. It's my daughter, whatever she wants. Yeah, without sucking on your piddle stick. Look, okay guys, that was a joke. I'm a clown. I'm a sad, lonely little clown. Hey, you're gonna put her on your show and you're gonna make sure she looks good. Look, okay, I got a lot of juice in this town, but I mean, I'm not a miracle. Just do it. Yeah. All right. All right, Trace, let's go. We gotta get to the therapist. What? So, I like call you or something, okay? <laughs> Bye. Never a family that needs therapy. My pony. How do I look? It's not good, is it? Who knew you could? 
could use a tattoo gun. It's one of those skills you pick up in prison. You know, inking your name on your celly's ass. Ew! Are you serious? Come on! Oh! Not to be difficult, but your therapist hasn't exactly been transformational to your mental health. So I don't know why you'd be better positioned to help for dysfunctionals. Hey, this was your mother's idea. Well, I guess it beats yoga. Huh? Now he beats yoga. Literally. Like Fabian? Around the head with a laptop? Oh, yes. Yeah. Our old man released the dude's inner tranquility all over the bean machine that is. To be honest, and I know it's karmically bad, but yeah, I fucking hate that dude. I know, right? So up his own ass. You're a fucking contortionist. Whoopee. I can cart my junk all day long. I don't act all superior about it. Just a little ashamed and empty inside. Overshare. Hey, guy was talking smack to your mother. Well, I applaud you, Pop. Here, here. You're like finally like using your powers of selfishness and rage for like good. Not an objective universal good, but like a subjective what's in our best interest kind of good. Fuck yeah! Awesome! Let's rob somebody! <laughs> do it, Dad! Yeah! Do, do it! it. Do, do it! it. Enough! Okay? I love that we're getting along, but knock it off! Yeah, don't like actually rob a liquor store. That might like kill the mood. Fucking therapy. Let's do that shit. Hey, how about you just let your mom and me talk, okay? We got some issues we gotta iron out. And seeing as you two aren't into it, you can just sit there and be quiet. That's cool with me. I got all the prescriptions I need, at, at least for the meantime. Thank you. Amanda! Hello! Good to see you again, Michael. I'm so glad. Isn't this great? Fantastic. Michael, be positive. I am being positive. <clears throat> this is me being positive. Give it up, Michael. The sarcasm. It's one of the reasons I moved out. It's beneath you. No, it's not, Amanda. Trust me. Nothing's beneath me. No, normally there's a whore beneath you. You know, for someone who spends every waking moment working on themselves inside and out, I gotta tell you, the progress has been really fucking slow. How would you know what progress is like, you stupid murdering shit? Uh, gee, because all you do is whine at me. Oh, all 
All I do is whine. Michael, could you please stop murdering people? Michael, could you please stop endangering me and the both of your children? You kill people and then you sit in the sun and drink and feel guilty about it. That is not work. I don't see you complaining on the way to the fucking bank. Let's face it, Amanda. We're trailer trash, you and me. We were taught to do this. Get a center, Michael. You have no center. How about you suck my cock? Huh? No way. We'll both get a center before that ever happens. You are such a fucking animal, a deranged animal. You're fucking ain't right on deranged. How could I not be? I should have had you locked up years ago, you stupid Do it. shit! Do it! I'll put you in the fucking ground with the rest of them. And that's really all the time we have. Oh. Great. I think we made some real progress there. <sighs> oh, uh, Michael. <laughs> I hope this goes without saying, but family work is a little more expensive. What, double? Squared. <laughs> of course. Yeah. Take care now. Hey. So you gotta come home with me or what? Guess we'll give it a try. All right then. Kid. So, will you drive us home? Cathartic. Catharsis all over my face. Ooh, I got a warm, fuzzy feeling. Probably just the meds you rated. Okay. Cathartic. Alright. I just don't want it to be more of the same. Now you're the one making the demands? No, 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 not demands. I, I, I'm saying... We gotta work at fixing it. We do. All of us. Yes, Mom. something in there. No one else gets this family. Not Dr. Friedlander, or my yoga teacher, or our tennis coach, or the juice guy, or the dog walker, or Oh, hey, hey. Or Jimmy's third grade teacher. Or the trash guy. Or dad's proctologist. Or the guy that thinks he's Jesus on Vespucci Beach. Or the hippie bum who thinks the world is ending. We're stuck with each other. I mean, how do you explain faking our deaths, changing our names, all the lying to the FIB, that monster Trevor? There's no explaining Uncle T. Hey, is he coming to the next therapy session? What? No. No. Jeez. Just one thing, Michael. Don't get us killed. And don't get killed. Can you do that?
Rooms. If you find dead bodies, cheap women, or Trevor Phillips, we're checking into the 